Hello everyone, I'm Michael Hughes, Managing Editor of Industrial Engineer Magazine, and I wanted to take a moment to tell you about this year's international issue, which will be sent to IE members in September. This special edition showcases the role industrial engineering plays in different countries that have a wide range of economic and cultural conditions. Among this issue's feature stories, contributing writer William W. Lawrence explains how Jamaica Producers Group has leveraged its capacity for agile supply chain management, entrepreneurial mindsets, and strategic partnerships to recover from economic decline. Teresa Ratcliffe writes that U.S. universities and industries should embrace their common cause by reflecting Germany's dual education apprenticeship model, which has become a hot economic development trend. Contributors Christos Zikopoulos and Dimitris Varzakakos explain how sampling and simulation simplified the environmental certification process for banks in Greece. And Annabella Alves brings a cautionary tale from Portugal to explain how applying lean manufacturing principles to healthcare could break down functional silos, serve patients better, and save lives. Other features in this special issue include stories about China's advances in manufacturing, a nuanced approach to analyzing the risk of global terrorism, students starting new IAE chapters in countries such as Mexico, Turkey, and the United Arab Emirates, and a recap of the International IAE Conference in Portugal. There are also more details about the facility tours that are going to be included in the upcoming Engineering Lean and Six Sigma Conference in Atlanta. IE members should check their mailbox in early September for their copy of the international issue, or you can read it online at the Industrial Engineer website, which is www.ienet.org/iemagazine.